Stretching their lead, but Kilkenny being Kilkenny, they got those all important points just before the break, and then they really needed them. Yeah, I heard the question got given away to City, you know, and actually uh, getting out to the team in the ball because Kilkenny are not doing their team well from far out the field. The ball was actually given big back to he brought the ball far the wing towards the goal. I would think that the biggest problem for Kilkenny is the middle of the team. I think Nigel Kennedy, I don't think, has hit the ball in this half yet. I think Richie Power for the brilliant player, he hasn't put the ball in the first half yet, you know. Paul Lachlan is not in the game. A lot of the Kilkenny players are not in the game, but they're still only five points from the door. I think they'll probably, Galway they have played really well in the, in the first half. When the players go to the second half, they can be back. Tom, can I pick up on one of the points that Tony was making? There about a couple of those fast screens. Do you think that Brian Cody has said he's talking in the run up to the match about Barry Kelly? Do you think it's going against him yesterday given some of the calls that he's made? Well, certainly he's refereeing the game very quickly, I have to say, Jackie, and maybe some people will see that that doesn't suit his own style. But I will say that he has refereed it very well. Now, I will, I, will, I will go back to one point, and I'd like to see it again, and that's the benefit that we have. We can look at replays and that. But uh, we've heard of the film, the 39, and the film, the 39 steps, don't so prefer two steps when you're going through that goal. I think everybody was caught up in the expansion of that. But other than that, I think Barry Kelly has done very, very well. But the Kelly don't seem to have the legs so far away at the moment. That's not to say, I think the Kelly needs to revert back to Richie Hoven up in top front, a few things like that, and this game is all the place for so. You know, it's, it's, it's all open. It's, it's open as far as I can see at the moment, and a uh, really, really intriguing game. Yeah, that uh, that issue is an interesting one because Mark yeah. in commentary yeah. even almost called us yeah. before the ball hit the net, and then uh, you're, you're, you're allowed ten steps in Galway. You know that uh, <laughs> uh, we always knew that. You know, you're allowed ten steps there. But look at having said that, he took the ball extremely well. You know, he didn't panic. He put the ball. Well, he could have put it when he got the step. Goal for Galway. That's all that's that ready for Joe Kenny. All right, Mr. Connor, I just said Mark was actually looking at me that time. He wasn't looking at the match. <laughs> you wouldn't want to mind what he said. I'm not not doing much. Yeah, we could have run that last time. <laughs> Half time here at Coke Park. It is Galway who lead in the All Ireland Senior Hurling final. 1 9 to kill Coe, 7 points. The minor match finish in a draw. Tipperary 2 0. Of the, 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 the,
but if we do have an extension of our staff agreement, that's not so